Uh, so welcome back guys. My name is Amlan and in today's Make Models Free campaign we try and solve keyboard issues reported by many Android users. And this often happens after you have done an Android update. So many OnePlus, many Samsung, many other users have reported that certain keys stop working or it's not as smooth as it was before. So they are reporting many usage issues with the keyboard that they have. Now please do understand that as far as the Samsung is concerned, you get what you call a Samsung keyboard by default. So this is basically the Samsung keyboard. And in case you are experiencing issues, what you can do is you can simply scroll down from the top, tap on the settings thing. So here, like you scroll down until you see general management. Under general management, you see language and input, and then you have the on-screen keyboard. So here, so basically you see, as of now, I have the default keyboard set to Samsung keyboard. So the keyboard which we were seeing was the Samsung keyboard. So here you can do various different things, but in case you are experiencing issues, what you need to do is reset to default settings. So here, like reset keyboard settings. So once you do this, all the problems should get fixed because the keyboard settings have now been reset to their original state. So this is what you can do. So once you reset to default settings, the keyboard should just work absolutely fine. And now like you should be able to type and do everything that you want. So well, as far as fixing issues is concerned, this is one thing that you can do. If in case this is not working, what you can also do is you can download a third party keyboard from the Play Store. Now there are many different keyboards. So I personally like the Microsoft and the Gboard. I mean the Google keyboard. So that's totally on you. So simply you can go ahead and install the keyboard. Once you do that, it will appear under the list of keyboards under language and input. So here it's finished installing. What I can now do is I can head towards my general settings. So under general management, under language input, under on-screen keyboard. And now when I look at manage keyboards, I will have the Microsoft Swift key keyboard, but it's not activated. So let me go ahead and toggle this to uh, on position and now I have this keyboard to select from however my default keyboard is still selected to the Samsung one I will advise switching on to Google keyboard or maybe a Microsoft keyboard while doing do this exercise caution so that you don't install something that is not safe well anyways in case I have to now shift this to Microsoft this is how I do this and now say for example I go ahead to Facebook you can see the keyboard has changed at any point of time I can change this and I can select from any of the keyboards that I have. So this is how you can change keyboards. And maybe if things are not working fine with a certain keyboard, you can think of switching on to the Google keyboard of Microsoft keyboard. So let me know how your experience is like with different keyboards and also let me know whether the problem is now fixed. In case you find this tutorial helpful, I would really love if you can subscribe to our channel, tap on the bell icon for getting notifications of our work. Share this with your friends on social network and surely if you can like the video, it really helps us. So until next time, it's me Amran signing off. Have a good one.